Alright guys, let's get started here. So yes, everybody welcome to this week's Pokemon TCG opening. Um, yeah, for, for those of you watching on Twitch, yeah, it's kind of late. You know, kind of started really late because I had other plans, but I am here, so no worries. So yes, as, uh, as I was asked, what we are opening, uh, we are opening up this huge box. I can't really fit the whole box on the screen. Eh, I can probably move the camera. So yes, uh, that probably wasn't very good. But yes, we're opening up a Tag Team Generations Premium Collection Box. So yes, uh, you can actually see uh, you can actually see the many goodies that are in there. Yeah, come promo cards. There's a coin there. Booster packs and uh, the jumbo promo card. More than one promo code. Mm -hmm. We'll see. We'll pop her open and see. And oh yes, there is a playmat there. We'll check out what that playmat looks like. Uh, so yeah, let's... Let's uh, open up this box. Where are we opening this up? Oh yeah, that's actually what the... That's what the box, back of the box looks like. Uh, that's actually what the playmat looks like. Can, uh, can actually see yeah, it's a little better picture but yes that is actually what the playmat looks like actually looks looks like a really cool playmat kind of excited to pop this open and actually see what it actually looks like do I play the online game no I do not play the online game, unfortunately. So maybe one of these days, so maybe use up some a lot of the unused codes, and maybe just like have a uh, a separate collection on the online game or something like that. You know, whenever I just you know get bored or whatnot. I don't know. Okay. We got her open. Alright, so let's actually let's actually look at this plane out here. Let's actually look at this bad boy. Yeah, dude, that is a nice looking playmat right there. Get all the, you know, all the Gen One starters with some, uh, you know, starters from a couple different generations of Pokemon. So you got Charizard, Brixen, Venusaur, Sneevy, Blastoise, Piplup. Man, that is that is a nice looking play, Matt. All right. So yeah, look forward to uh, seeing that play, Matt, at uh, future openings. Cause I do rotate. I just, I am rotating play mats. Different play mats every week, so. We'll be throwing this puppy into the rotation for future openings. Try to place it right. I'll place it right there. All right. Right. I do. I do have a whole bunch of um, 
uh, just paper playmats. Um, not only for Pokemon, but for Yu-Gi-Oh as well. Have a bunch of those. All right, so uh, let's get to our to our stuff here. Yep, of course have our promo cards. Have our coin as what's what's uh, as what's mentioned. This, oh yes, that is the Charizard and Brixen coin, right there. Yeah, you want? I do kind of actually like that. Um, here, actually, I'll use the giant card. A little easier to see. If, of course, I can get the card out. There we go. We got, we got it out. So, yes, you know, as you can see, this is... One is kind of bigger than the other. So, yes, we'll take a look at the... The giant Charizard and Breaks and Courage. Oh wow, there is actually so much glare on that. Yeah, the lighting, not good. Yes, that is the giant Charizard and Brakeson. I see if the smaller one is better. Yeah, it looks like the smaller one's a little bit better. Not quite as much glare. So yeah, we'll quickly go through what Charizard and Brakeson does. It's got brilliant fire. Sorry, no. No, 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 no. That's not what it says. It's got brilliant flare for 180 damage. When you search your deck for up to three cards, put them into your hand, then shuffle your deck. Pretty good. Does GX move Crimson Flame Pillar? Attach five energy, attach five basic energy cards from your discard pile to your Pokemon any way you like. If this Pokemon has at least one extra energy attached to it, your opponent's your opponent's active Pokemon is now burned and confused. Yes, that is Charizard and Brixen. The alternate art full art. And of course, that's not the only one you get. You also do get a Venusaur and Sneavy alternate art promo card. That one actually looks. That one actually looks pretty cool. Looks like it. Oh yeah, it's the clay model. It's the clay model art. Oh uh, yeah. Uh, I'm assuming that. I'm assuming this box. Uh, has a code card. Just have to figure, find it. So these are Stevie with the shining vine of it ability. Once during your turn, this Pokemon is the active Pokemon when you attach a grass energy card from your hand to it. And we switch one of your opponent's bench Pokemon with their active Pokemon. So in other words, sort of a a free gust in a way. It's got Forest Dump for 160 damage. And she GX move Solar Plant. This attack does 50 damage to each of your opponent's Pokemon. Pokemon, if this Pokemon has at least two extra energy attached to it, heal all damage from all of your Pokemon. So yes, that is Venusaur and Sneevy. Yeah, I think we'll 
I'll put them right at the top right there. Yeah, usually, usually boxes like this do come with uh, a code card for the box. Uh, we'll find out if it has one. So yes, packs that you get in the box. We have two Cosmic Eclipse in one, two, three, Four, five, unified minds. So we get seven packs, which is not bad. So I'll place those right there. And oh yes, here we are. I was right. There is a code card. You know, it's just uh, very, very well hidden. Uh, and here we go. There is the code card for the Tag Team Generations Premium Collection. So there we go. I probably imagine you probably get you probably get these two promos in the play mat. I'm guessing. I'm just guessing. Not a huge fan of the Venusaur Sneevy art. Mm -hmm. Oh well. Can't like them all. Alright. Oh, it's the two cards in the coin? Well... Oh, well, I got the two I got the two cards part right. <laughs> so yes, anyways, uh so you have seven packs. Um can't really stop at seven packs, that's not really much of an opening. Um So I have so I have uh, you know a whole bunch more cosmic clips and unified minds. You know, to kinda you know, make the opening at least a little bit of an opening. Um, yeah, yeah, you are right. It is uh, yeah, it is kind of like I think they actually call this. I think they call this foiling the shattered glass foil. I believe that's what they call it. Call it the shattered glass foil. And there, there are actually, um, there are actually shattered glass uh, foil cards that you can, that you can actually find in some, in some uh, boxes and uh, theme decks and whatnot. But they do look pretty cool. I actually do have, I do have a. Uh, a bunch of uh, shower glass. Not sure if it's. I'm pretty sure it's called shatter glass, or they might call it shattered ice. I'm not sure. Uh, but anyway, so we do have. So we have a total of 18 packs, beautify minds, and 18 packs, cosmic eclipse. So we got the half and half. You know our own little custom booster box. That we like to do. So yes. So yes, here we go. So let's get started here. Um, I guess we'll start off with uh, Unified Minds here. The Search for Secret Rare Mewtwo and Mew GX, by the way. It is part of that search for series that we uh, that we started uh, last week. So who knows? Maybe we can uh, we can pull one here. Should be pretty awesome. Blue 
nice. Hmm, nice. Hmm, yeah. Yeah, we all know you'll be around, right, you? Uh, I'm going to put energy cards. Um, I guess I'll just make a pile over here. I guess seems pretty good. Oh yeah, that's right. They have the box and the, the codes for the sleeves. That's right. Alright, so starting off with a reverse hollow Pokemaniac. Pokemaniac, actually one of my favorite full arts. So maybe I'll pull one of those. And starting off with a Lucario. One of the much more popular Pokemon. Uh, I'm gonna put... Uh, I guess I'll put the reverse hollow pile right there. Seems alright. So yeah, um, I guess we're kind of hoping for, you know, maybe, maybe a few Ultras from each set, I, I think. Uh, most of these are just loose packs, so, you know, ratios are going to be a little wonky, but that's kind of what happens with loose packs. Ratios become wonky. Hey, we got the big beaver. Big beaver and the big bird. Or the big dark bird, actually, I should say. There's a lot of different kind of birds. Pikachu, Pikachu Elite Train Box. Oh, okay. I know what I know which one that is. That's the that is the Team Up Elite Trainer Box. Uh oh, Generations. Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah, G Generations Elite Trainer Boxes are really expensive now, though. Like, like over here in Canada, a uh, Generations Elite Trainer Box, I think are... I think they go for like $100 each over here. Like, crazy expensive Elite Trainer Box. Ooh, Tapu Fini. Getting one of the Tapu Island Guardians. Yeah. I, I don't know if... I probably won't end up... Uh... Probably won't end up getting a uh, another generations Elite Trainer box because yeah they are hundred and thirty five dollars Amazon yeah yeah they are expensive Elite Trainer boxes. Like honestly, if I if I'm ever gonna 
if I'm ever gonna like maybe get some more generations packs, I'm probably just gonna end up buying like loose packs. Hey, Tapu Coco, that's a uh, reverse rare. So that's pretty neat. Ooh, Necrozma. Wait, that's also one of the better rares in the set. Yeah, 100, 135 US. Trying to think of trying to think of what that that's gonna be. I think that's about uh, I think it's about $180 Canadian, I believe. $170-$180 Canadian, I think. Somewhere around there. Like, honestly, like, loose... If you're just looking for generations packs, you're probably just better off... Uh, much better off just getting loose packs. But then even then, like... A single pack of generations is still quite expensive. Like they're probably they're probably now like what ten dollars Canadian a pack or something. They're they are very very expensive packs. So, you know, you know, unfortunately, as of, you know, right now, probably aren't going to see me uh, open up any more Generations packs on here. Well, he's as it stands right now. In the future, that might change, but... Who knows? Hey, we got a Pikachu! We got the little beaver. Alright, Fracture. Ooh, Electros! That's another, another reverse rare. So that is pretty sweet. Hey, our first foil card. We have an Iggy Slash. All right, there we go. First foil card. Awesome. All right. There you go, guys. One foil. Hopefully many. Let's see. Next pack here. Yes. Oh uh, yes, yeah. Generations Elite Trainer Boxes. Uh, do you have a Shaman EX promo card in them? And um, I believe they also have uh, ten, uh, ten booster packs instead of the uh, usual eight that most Elite Trainer Boxes have. I know, I know that um, certain Elite Trainer Boxes that have promo cards in them, uh, they'll have 10 booster packs instead of 8 usually. And that is a very glary wind pod. And a cross soul! So we got the big, big crab.
There we go. Finally, the camera focus. The camera did it. For at least an ultra rare of these uh, new five minds packs, haven't really got much out of the set so far, other than the one foil and a couple reverse rares. So we have some cottony floating around here. And none pheasants. Got another big bird. Okay, that packs pack opened up pretty interestingly. Okay, now we get the Dweeble for the Crustle. Oh, hey, there's Misty. That, that is actually a pretty cute looking uh, Misty artwork right there. Give him a little wink. We got the big wise owl. Onyx. Onyx reverse and ice. There we go. Finally, getting ultra rare out of here. There we go. So here we are. Rowlet in a little executor GX ultra rare card. That Rowlet looking uh, pretty angry. Like he's uh, wanting to fight with another Pokemon, maybe. Very, very nice. So there we go. Finally, we got an ultra rare card. Stick that, I guess, right in the middle there. There we go. First good hit the, of the night. How many packs we got left? Yeah, what? Eh, nine more packs of Unified Minds. Let's see what else we can get out of here. Oh, maybe you can get another ultra or the ultra or better would be pretty sweet. Got the scorpion. Oh, Pokemon slacking off. Tornadoes. Cause why not? Like a tongue reverse. And a Metacham. Where is Metacham? Looks like he's on the rocks by the shore there. Couple more before we find out 
what the uh, Tag Team Generations box has got in their Unified Minds packs. The Grass Energy. Mmm, Cherish Ball. Actually, one of the one of the better uncommons. Very nice. Any codes shown in the past few minutes? No. No codes were shown. Don't worry. Haven't missed any codes. There we go. So there's a drill burr. And nice! Alright! Another ultra rare card. This time it is Garchomp Giratina. Very, very nice. I think. I think. I'm pretty sure it's this one that's actually one of the, the more valuable. One of the more valuable ultra rares of the set. Of course, the most valuable one, of course, being the Mewtwo and Mew. Very, very nice. So there we go. All right. Now we're finally starting to get some stuff. Oh, uh, these Unified Minds packs. Now the hits are starting to flow through here. All right. Here we go, so couple more packs before I found out what the box packs had. Energy puke and muke. Oh, there's the there's the electric. So now we just now 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 we just need uh what's the other one? Tynamo. We just need a Tynamo. We'll have the full line of the full Tynamo line in reverse foils. Hey, Velto Hollow Rare. That is also very sweet. I believe you Velto is uh, one of the better Hollow Rares of the set. Uh, to get. So that is awesome. Very, very nice. Yeah, yeah. yeah Unified Minds packs are doing pretty good. Um, oh yeah, you want, I guess something we can actually talk about, um, so yeah, S what is it, SGQ 2020 submissions are, are actually open, uh, might have been open for a few days now, we still got about, what, six or so days left to submit games before submissions close. So yeah, I've already submitted off uh, a few games. Still kind of decide on what my last game I want to submit for my five games that you're allowed to submit. Um, but I'll, uh, I'll think about it. I'll have to go through the games less and figure out which one I want to submit. But yeah, kind of 
Kind of looking forward to uh, SGQ once again out in uh, out in Minnesota. Heck, maybe, maybe this will be the year I'll get a game into both an AGDQ and SGQ in the same year. That would be awesome. Uh, anyways, alright, let's find out what the box had in its Unified Minds packs. So here we go, pack number one. Ooh, that thumb, that thumb, that thumbnail's getting a little long. I have to think about cutting that one down a little bit. I'm going to use those pesky nail clippers. Hey, there's blue. Those of you that play gold, silver, and crystal, blue was the was the leader of uh, Viridian City. I think he was also the, actually the champion in uh, red, blue, yellow, I believe. Hey, another reverse rare. We got an Obama Snow. That was very nice. And nice, dude. Another ultra rare card. The box coming through with another one. Very, very nice. So here we are, Aerodactyl, Aerodactyl GX. Sadly, one of the lesser valued GX cards in the set, but uh, still pretty nice to. Uh, Pull an ultra rare card. Very, very nice. That is three ultras now. Do do Elias. He's also known as Gary. Do. Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's that's right. He is also known as Gary. And, and actually, what's really cool was that in the game, they actually did pretty good at making the sprites, like the sprites, to look like Gary. So, they actually did very, very good in the Pokemon games to look like have blue look like Gary. Huh, I did not know. I did not know why is that card upside down. Uh, I did not know Gary actually became a professor himself. Like his, uh, like, uh, like Professor Oak. Uh, then again, like, like, I haven't seen the Pokemon anime in a long time. Oh, that Delmise kind of made it upside down in the pack. Stunfist. And ooh, still Valley Hall there. Very nice. That is a that's a pretty neat Hall of Rare card. Certainly take that one. Actually, oh, he revived an Aerodactyl. Well, that's really neat. Uh, 
Hey, good on Gary for helping out that Aerodactyl. Also keeping it out of the hands of Team Rocket. Because as we all know, Team Rocket, that darn Jesse and James, they're always up to trouble. Hey, great potion. No, no one of the better trainer cards. Pawn edge. So we got the sword. Ooh, second Drapion. Our second big scorpion. Uh yeah, it's been it's been so long since I saw the anime. Like the last time I watched the anime, like Gary was like you know, Gary was like Ash's, you know, big rival in the Pokemon series, like a while back. You know that 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 that's that's sort of the last you know that I've that I've known about what Geary Oak was all about was just you know which has always been Ash's you know big rival when it came to like you know pokey battles and whatnot and earning all those badges. Try to become, you know, the champion. So we got, we got a balloon, and another big crab. Second one of those. All right, here we go. Last pack, of unify mines. Means it's time to give away the code in this pack. Last chance to get a secret rare Mewtwo and Mew out of here as well. So we'll see if this see if we get some last pack magic gav here. Be pretty sweet. And there we go. Got a good shot of that code right there. Alright, here we go. Let's get some last pack magic out of here. Come on, Unified Minds. Oh, it's got fire already. We're already doing good. Ooh, Giant Hearth. Another really good trailer card. Got a Lorantis. And last rare card is eh, just a blimp. Just the big blimp. Oh nice, slow poke at Psyduck. Congrats on getting that nice little GX card. Alright, so. So we got a few Ultras all out of Unified Minds, so that's not bad. Uh, unfortunately, no. Full Arts and Secret Piles are kind of looking a little empty, but. But that's alright. Alright, here we go, guys. Cosmic Eclipse. So here we go. This is the search. Or a secret rare. One of these guys. Basically looking for the secret rare of, uh, you know, this guy right here.
Okay, that code was in there the wrong way. Alright. Oh well. Yeah, I mean, pulling, pulling a GX card, you know, doesn't matter if it's a uh, regular ultra rare, full or a secret one. It's always pretty sweet. Hey, I got me! I pulled me in the first pack of Cosmic Clits. There we go. That's a sign that we're going to get some good cards out of here. Oh, look at that. You even got the Eevee to go, to go with it. Alright. Alright, wow. Dude, that was a good pack. We got we got Decidueye Hall of Air. Yeah, that was a good pack. We got a Hall of Air. We got the best Eevee Lucian. And we got Eevee. That's a good pack right there. I'm liking that. There we go. We'll make a second row for uh, Cosmic Eclipse here. Just kind of move everything up so that they at least, they at least are still on the camera. Uh, yes, make me pile. All right, here we go. Pack opened up very weird. Okay, so apparently. In these Cosmic Eclipse, pa Eclipse packs, the codes are facing the other way. Okay. Guess I won't, won't complain too much about it. No. Just don't, just don't want to be spoiling myself as to what, what may or may not be in the pack. Hey, there's red and blue. You know, two very awesome Pokemon games right there. Uh, Whimsicott. That is a reverse rare. So that's pretty nice right there. And Mimikyu. Very nice. Alright. Trying to, trying to, trying to just fling off that code card really quick, you know. Don't want to spawn it for, for everyone. Don't want to spawn it for myself either. Oh, we got the roller skater. Roller skater is here. Skating along. Hey, Excadrill! The reverse rare. That's pretty awesome. And Mars Shadow. With uh, yeah, Pikachu, you can see right there, making a little cameo on the side there. Oh yeah, wait, hold on, I almost forgot this cosmic eclipse are opening up. So we can actually we can actually get rev we can get reverse secret rares. Or I mean, I call them reverse secret rares because if you get one they take the place of a reverse hollow. So 
so I like to call them re re reverse secrets. But yeah, that's right. And uh, and also uh, we uh, found out that from the massive opening that we did with uh, Cosmic Eclipse, um, you're guaranteed four reverse secret rares per box. Which is kind of nice. You know, nice to be, be guaranteed secret rares in booster boxes. Pyroar! Oh no, it's just an uncommon. I thought Pi War was a uh, rare for a second, but it's not. So, there we go. Pi Roar. Come on, oh, Hollow Rare. Very nice. That is our second Hollow Rare card. This one's a little miscut, though. You can see there is a, there's a lot of border on that one side. Uh, not a lot of border on the other side, though. Might be a little hard to tell. Actually, no, you can actually tell right there. It's a little far to one side there. Same with that decision why too. A little off cut. Alright, hey, what is that? What are the choose when you put active Pokemon's non GX attacks? Use it as this attack. Yeah, that actually could be pretty good. Try, try to think. That'd be good for... That'd be good for, for the poison type Pokemon cards. Because poison, poison type Pokemon cards are now uh, psychic types. And... And uh, poison types are poison type Pokemon are weak to psychic. Some drain, um, some brain type cards. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah, you know what, I think, no, you're right, there are some, there are some dragon type cards that are weak to its own type. That is true. Um, oh yeah, I think even, um, psychic types, uh, psychic type Pokemon are weak to their own type as well. Oh, there's Flareon! We got another evolution. There we go, Phantom. And nice! Got an ultra rare card. Nice, so here we are, an Oricorio GX. Oh, excuse me. So there we go, finally pulling an ultra rare card out of Cosmic Eclipse here. Uh, I know I know there's four different types of Oricorios. I think pretty sure I think this is the psychic type, although there's actually technically two psychic type ones. I think one of them is an actually psychic type. I think it might be this one is the psychic type one. I don't know. Let me know which which Oricorio 
that one is. It's one of the psychic type ones, we'll just say that. Next pack here. Still searching. Do we haven't even gotten a full art yet? Well, a little secret. Come on, pack. So I'd like to pull at least at least one full art or something out of here would be pretty nice. There we go, guys. There's one of those reverse secret rare cards. There we are. There's the Weevil. There we go, who was in the background there? But Cyrus! Cyrus is in the, uh, the background there. Very, very nice, very pretty card there. Yes, very, very weevil Pokemon indeed. So there we go, finally getting a secret rare out of here. That's what we're talking about. And the big whale. Yes, there we go, finally. So, we at least we got a secret rare of some kind! So, that's good. Alright. It's looking promising, everybody. Woo. It's looking promising. We might actually get an actual secret rare out of here, maybe. Maybe, maybe, just maybe. There we go, we got the evil weevil. So that is pretty cool. Oh, we got some bee states. Ooh, Jolteon, very nice. So there we go, we got the three OG evolutions now. A quick tune and a lantern. Okay, okay. All right, that's all right. It's all right. We got the we got the three OG evolutions now. Actually, I should pull them out. I'm gonna pull the evolutions out and find a spot. I think the next one's Flareon. Okay, Pori. Oh, we got the first. There we go. There we go. We're bossing out the evolutions. Uh, put them right here. There we go. We'll put them at the top right there. Of course, got, we gotta put, you know, of course, Vaporeon on top. Gotta put Vaporeon on top. He's the best one. I also wonder if there's any other ones that are, in, are in Cosmic Eclipse, or if it's just the 
three OG ones. I don't know, we'll find out. Hey, there's the uncommon Mimikyu. We got the Polka Doll. Hello, Reverse Jolteon. All right. Evolutions flying in full force. And we have the Empoleon, the big penguin. Alright. Alright, here we go. Next pack here. Still have them for full art, though. Here's our Sneasel going with our Weevil. Sneasel Weevil. Hey, there's Will of the uh, Johto Elite Four. Alright, Simeon and. Ooh, Dr. Reflex. There we go. Finally getting a full art. Man, that took a while. So here we are, Megalopunny and Jigglypuff. So there we go, finally get a full out of here. Um, trying to think, I don't think this is one of the more valuable full arts in the set. I think this is still, I think, like, still think it's got to be, like, I don't know, six, seven dollar card, still. I mean, I mean, you get, you get your pack value back with this one card, so that's always pretty, that's always nice to get your, uh, pack value back in a pack. Yes, there we go. Finally, getting a full art out of here. Very nice, everybody. All right, things looking up. Now all we're missing is um. All we're missing now is just an actual secret rare. That is all we're missing now. Let's see if we can, uh... See if we can actually get one out of here. Be... Pretty sweet. Oops. And we got the Carvana na na na. Oh, we got the... Oops. Seal. Got the Bi Sharp. Oh, we got a reverse little whale. Just a little whale. And nice! Dude, another ultra rare card! You have Sogalio and Lunala GX. Dude, that is awesome. You can actually see. Can actually see Lily right there, riding on the back of Sagalio there. Uh, believe this is uh, also one of the um, better ultra rares you can get out of Cosmic Eclipse. So that is awesome. So, so there we go, guys. We got the sun and the moon.
of of a single pack. Come on, camera. Come on, camera. I know the sun is bright, but you can focus in on it. There we go. That's a good shot right there. All right, there we go. That is a nice ultra rare card to get. <laughs> Ooh. That one ripped open. packs we got last we got one two five seven more packs cosmic eclipse after this one of course seven more chances to pull a secret rare Charizard and breaks in that is the car we are Search for. So we got the Sand True and the Brave Bird. Very cool. Oh, jeez. Oh, my goodness. Everything's falling over. Oh, jeez. Okay, good thing these are just energy cards that fell on the floor. <laughs> oh boy. The packs! They're alive! Oh man! Alright. Alright, don't worry guys. Packs are under control now. It won't be going anywhere anytime soon. Alright, there we go. We got a pawn for a chess game. Got the snow runs. Hey, there's Misty and Lorelei. Two lovely ladies there. Actually, another pair of lovely ladies we could pull on the set is uh, Cynthia and Caitlin. That would actually be a very nice card to pull. Ooh, Groudon! Getting, uh, getting the Team Magma Pokemon out of here. And also one of the legendary Pokemon, of course. Revenge of Pack Pax East. Uh okay. I've never been to Pax East, so like I've never been to Pax East, so I mean that joke just went Woo Oh wow, the car was actually the right way this time. <laughs> oh. Oh, well. Oh, well. Sorry about that. See, what when you said Pax East, that that was immediately the first thing that came to my mind was the PAX East Gathering event. You know, I'm, I'm sure if you probably said it to most other people, that's immediately what they would think about. It's just, oh, PAX East. 
Yeah, that event and whatnot. Hey, Victini! Hollow Rare, that's nice. It's a very pretty little foil card there. Alright. Yeah. Yeah, that's alright. That's alright. Uh, at least I immediately... You know... At least I immediately thought of a PAX East. Just, uh... Yeah. Sadly not the one you were going for. <laughs> Packed falling off of the table. Oh. Um. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Don't really understand the joke, but okay. Oh, we got Tepeg. And a swoo bat, which course rever which course evolves from woo bat. You know, totally changed the name from evolve from its basic Pokemon to evolve form. <laughs> Alright, how many more packs? We got three more packs after this one. So we're getting down to the nitty gritty. Da -na -na -na. All right, coffee. Probably by the time I get up tomorrow, tomorrow morning, if you get ready for it. Might need some coffee. And nice. Hey, a Venusaur and Sneezy. There we go. Look at that. There we go. We actually we got its buddy. Yay. There we go, we got double the Venusaur and Sneevy now. Kamen doesn't want to focus very well on it though. There we go. Yeah, the clay art one, which is this one, this is the this is the alternate full art uh one that we uh we got in the box. So there you go. That is awesome. Got we got its body. Hey, I say we've actually done pretty well for uh, ultra rares this opening. Just uh, not not much of anything else though, but. I mean, I'll definitely take Ultra Rares all day. Can't complain about that. Alright. Here we go. Third to last pack here. Looking for a little bit of last pack magic going on here. 
Wow, another Passimi in reverse. And, ooh, wow, nice. The back-to-back -back ultra rare cards. There we go, getting the, uh, so we are, this is the, this is the, the small wishy-washy GX. Yeah, this is the, uh, this is the small one. Um, oh, I'm trying to think. What's, what's, uh, has the big wishy-washy one? I think, I think it's Guardians Rising has the, the big wishy-washy GX one. I think. Sounds, it sounds right. Yeah, there we go. That is two ultra rare cards in a row. That is very good. So yes, there we go. Small wishy washy GX. Come on, let's get one more good shot of it. There we go. Man, just piling on the ultra rares here. Alright guys, here we go. Last two packs of Cosmic Clips. These are the ones from the box. Let's see what the box has got. Uh oh, this one's hard to open. That's a good sign. Second to last pack. First one. First of the box. Cosmic Clip Packs. Let's see if the box has got any. Well, it's got clay. Clay is here. Alright, Trapinch. And Fion. Non hollow rare. Here we go. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that is the, uh, that's the wrong kind of clay to, to mold anything with. Just kind of the wrong kind of clay. All right, here we go. Last pack, Cosmic Eclipse. Giving away the last coat of the night. Uh, maybe. If the code wants to give it away, I'm not even sure. Camera. <laughs> There we go, there we go. Camera did it. Alright. Camera did it, here we go. Alright, last chance. Last chance for Secret Rare Charizard and Brakeson. Can we do it? Oh, Flareon. Flareon's here, he's bringing the fire. Alright. Reverse fly baby, that's our last reverse. And oh It was another ultra rare card. Ah, oh, that's alright. That's alright, it's an ultra rare card, we'll take it. Man, we've done so well with these ultra rare cards. How many is that now? One, two, three there. One, two, three, 
four. That's our eighth ultra rare card. Wow. Uh, that's pretty good for uh, 36 loose packs. That is, that's almost... It's about one every four... One every 4.5 packs that we got, that we got one. That's actually very, very good. So yes, here we are. Megalo Pony and Jig and Puff come back. One last appearance here. Very nice here. All right, let me just organize these piles. All right, so. Uh, well, we didn't hit any, um, actual secret rares other than the weevil here but hey we still actually did pretty good got a lot of very very nice cards so now let's go let's uh, let's do the recap here um yeah we'll start off with the uh you know of course the OG Evolutions here, we did get them all. So, very nice that we got all of those. Uh, alright. Alright, so we'll start with Unified Minds. Just kind of... Kind of go quickly through those. So, Unified Minds, Reverse Hollows. Uh, quickly go through them. Got a bomb of snow in the air. Other good ones. Electros. Tapu Coco. It's all good. Reverse. Re reverse forms there. Alright, for our hollow rares. In Unified Minds, we got Silvalli, Eveltal, and Eggy Slash. And for all of our cards in Unified Minds, we got Aerodactyl, Garchomp Giratina, and Rowlet and the Wolf Executor. All right, now for Cosmic Eclipse. So once again, go through the reverse foil cards. I mean, did we get any reverse rares? Oh yeah, the Excadrill and the Whimsicott were the reverse rares that we got. Right, right, right. Okay. Come on. Hollow Red Cards of Cosmic Eclipse. We got Victini, Kamo'o, and Decidueye. For Ultra Red Cards, we had Megalopunny and Jigglypuff, The Small Wishy Washy. Venusaur and Sneevy, Sigalio and Lunala, the Sun and the Moon, and one of the many Oricorios. And then speaking of Megalopony and Dragonpuff, this was our only full art card that we got. And then our one in only secret rare was the good old evil weevil. See there, stand there with Cyrus. Clan Undertaker with the follow. Thank you so much, Clan Undertaker. Every little bit of support helps. 
and is much appreciated. Hopefully you're doing well and having a good weekend. Yes, I did give away three codes already. Uh, unfortunately for you, you kind of came in at the very end of the opening. You know, very, very sorry about that. But, um, but do not worry. Um, uh, this will be up on YouTube uh, later on. So, you know, just because you missed it during the live stream, don't worry. It'll be up on there, up on the YouTube channel. So, you can go back and watch. So, yes, there we go, guys. That is the end of this week's opening. Got a lot of pretty awesome cards there. I also can't forget about this. Jumbo Charizard and Braxton. So yes, that is it. Um, uh, yeah, probably this week I'll try to figure out what what one other game I will uh, 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 submit off to SGDQ. Um, Actually, well, I kind of have an idea of what I want to uh, have my fifth game submit off to be. Though I'm, though I'm going to need to work on it, so probably, hopefully Monday. Hopefully Monday I will uh, uh, get around to uh, applying it, working on it and everything. Um, and oh yeah, next week is uh, March break. You know, I know... All you, uh, all you people out there are getting excited for March break. Maybe. You know. So yeah, you know. Lots of things to look forward to. Anyways, that is the end. So, thank you everybody for watching. And until next time, everybody. Have a great night. Take care. Now, see you guys next time.